Hi, how are you doing? Uh, I'm fine, thank you. Where are you from? Ukraine. Oh. Привет. Привет. How long is your trip in Vietnam? Uh, totally, it's one month. For vacation? Yeah, it's for vacation. What do you do for a living? I'm self-employed, so I'm working with Amazon. Why did you decide to come to Vietnam? It's a wonderful country and I like traveling around Asia. And I've never been here, so I just decided to come here and discover this country. Also, food, maybe. I just made a small research uh, before. Food in Vietnam is very good. <laughs> a lot of good reviews about food. And also, maybe budget, also. How much is the budget for the trip in uh, Vietnam? I'm staying here for one month, so my budget is around 2,000 and half US dollars. Where is your favorite place in Vietnam? I'm just in the middle of my trip, but the most I liked Hoi An. Previously been there, so it's very good. Have you faced any culture shock in Vietnam? Actually, no. A lot of friendly people around and all Vietnamese are very helpful and always want to help you. So maybe not. Only rats a little bit, <laughs> like they're running around. I've seen one in a restaurant, but still it was the only one situation I faced, actually. Do you have any advice for other Western travelers? I would advise to travel around country and not to stay in one place. So it is better to discover a different Vietnam region, south, central, so we are currently in center now, and uh, the north too. You speak English very well. <laughs> no, no. How many languages do you speak? Uh, I speak three language, languages. Ukrainian, it is my, like, I'm native speaker. English and a little bit Japanese. Japanese, great. <laughs> How did you learn English? I learned it since my childhood and also I continued to learn it in school and in university too. Yeah. Thank you for your time. Thank you for... Jaku. <laughs> Jaku. Hi, how are you doing? Good. <laughs> <Okay. laughs> thank you. Yeah. You look very friendly. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. You do too. <laughs> thank you. Where are you from? We're from Denmark, Denmark, Copenhagen. How long is the trip in Vietnam? We are traveling around for Vietnam in a month. A month. Yeah. yeah. What do you do for a living? Nothing right now. <laughs> uh, we just saved up some money uh, working in a kindergarten. Um, but we're having our gap year right now. So we saved up for this trip. What's your plan in Vietnam? <laughs> we just want like to explore the country and like travel from north to south. So yeah. Oh, yeah. So you went to Ho Chi Minh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We started there. We don't like plan too much at a time. We just you know take things as they come. We know we want to do the Ha Chiang move. Yeah, um, yeah. <laughs> You travel to other countries as well? Yeah, yeah. We just spent one month in uh, Thailand. Thailand. Yeah. And after Vietnam, we're going to Bali for a month. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. The beach. Yeah, <laughs> yeah exactly. <laughs> we love the beach. <laughs> yeah. I know that. <laughs> <laughs> Have you faced any culture shock in Vietnam? No. I think when we went to Thailand at first, we like, I think maybe they're pretty similar. So not like a shock, but it's nice to see like the different cultures. Yeah. yeah. Do you eat Vietnamese food? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Love it. <laughs> <laughs> but it's a lot of pork. I don't eat that yeah. much pork at all. Like that's a bit of a shock. I didn't know they ate like that much pork. Oh, <laughs> yeah. You look healthy, so you take care of your food. Usually. <laughs> yeah. Try to. <laughs> what are you proud of about your country? Maybe that we're almost like every person are equal. Like we have like same opportunities to go to college, go to university and stuff like that. Yeah. yeah. I mean, we pay high taxes, but I mean, I think it's worth it. Because, you know, hospital is free and school is free. I mean, we even get paid to go to school. Yeah. So. <laughs> There are a lot of very good opportunities in Denmark. And I agree. <laughs> people are so nice. Yeah. I think people can seem like a bit rude when you don't talk to them. Like and reservated maybe. Yeah. It's not like you know, go around here, people would just say hello and stuff like that. People don't really do that in Denmark. But if you go up to someone and talk to them, they will be so friendly and yeah. kind and always help you. Yeah. So. 
Do you have any dating advice for guys? Dating advice, advice? for guys? <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't know. Like, I think it's very personal for girl to girl, like what they like. But I love a guy who's uh, very like friendly and sweet and just honest and directly about like Has what he wants. Has humor. Humor. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you gotta be fun. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for your time. Yeah, thank, thank you. Tak. 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 Hi, how are you doing? I'm good. I'm good. How are you? Good, thank you. Where are you from? I'm from England. I've been to London once. Yes. Yeah. I, I used to, uh, so I was living in London with my girlfriend for the last five years. And then we've quit our jobs and just come to Asia, really, to, to see where we like and where we want to live next. How long is the trip in Vietnam? We've been here one month, but we're going to stay for one and a half months oh, okay. in total. So are you traveling in other countries as well? Yeah, yeah. So we started in Thailand, but we actually went back home to England for Christmas and then we came out to, I'm trying to remember, we went out to the Philippines, spent a month there, we went to Malaysia, spent about three weeks there, a month and a half in Vietnam, and then we're actually going back to the Philippines because we have a wedding to go to. What do you do for a living? My girlfriend and I, we actually have started our own online business. We sell toothbrushes, you know, we've designed a, a new sort of eco-friendly toothbrush that is low waste and low consumption. So it's bamboo, but you only throw away the, the head and you keep the handle. Uh, it's called Sista. So, where is your favorite place in Vietnam? On this trip, we've actually only been in Da Nang. But I came what seven years ago, and I went all over. And actually, Da Nang is my favorite by far. I did like Sapa a lot. I'd recommend it. It's in the far north of Vietnam, almost like by the border with China. But uh, it's very mountainous. It's quite a bit colder than here. It's beautiful. It's amazing. But in terms of of living. I love Da Nang. I love the beach. I love the weather. It's so cheap. There's a lot of tourists about, but it's not too busy or, or feeling crowded. And there's lots of good gyms. Oh, yeah. And I like that. <laughs> How often do you exercise? Now, probably like six times a week. But now I've got the time to do it. So it's great. Before in London, when I was working full time, it was more like four times a week, maybe five. And it's cool here because they've got the beach gyms. Yeah. So, you know, you can just go, it's free. You don't have to pay for anything or wear any attire. And you just swim when you get hot. Amazing. That's right. You can surf as well. Thank you for your time. No, yeah. no problem. Have Thank a nice you. Trip. You too. Hi, how are you doing? Hi, Hi. good. Thank you. Where are you from? Uh, we are all free from Germany. Guten Tag. <laughs> How long is your trip in Vietnam? For about one month. We do like a backpacking through Asia. Will you go to other countries? Yes, we went to uh, Thailand and the next is... Um, Indonesia. Yes. Bali. Bali, yes, yes Bali. of course. <laughs> in every country one month. <laughs> yeah, long trip. Yes. yes. What do you do for a living? We quit our jobs to go to Asia. Yes, for the trip we quit our jobs. <laughs> what did you do? We worked in an office, me in HR. Um, in the logistics, uh, she works on the uh, um, optical. optical. Car. Why did you decide to come to Vietnam? We heard the people here are very friendly. You can do all here for very cheap prices. It's not so touristic like um, Thailand, Thailand or and the Bali. other stuff or Bali. Yes. And so it's pretty nice here. Quiet. Yes, yeah, it's quiet. Yeah, it compared to Thailand. Exactly, yeah. yeah. Where is your favorite place in Vietnam so far? I think mine is Giang Lu, like the tour in the north. True. That was amazing experience. Yeah. And here is also really nice with the beach. <laughs> we love the beach, so it's pretty nice here too. Did you swim here? Yes, yes of course. <laughs> And we want to um, rent some surfboards. Oh. Go like surfing. Yeah. 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 Have you faced any culture shock in Vietnam? Yes, uh, we went to a restaurant in Hanoi and they gave us peanuts and they cracked them open and throw them everywhere on the floor. Oh, yeah, true. Yes. Everything, the <laughs> throw it away. <laughs> everywhere on the floor they put them. Do you eat Vietnamese food? Yes, only. Oh, no. Yeah, we love <laughs> Vietnamese food. It's amazing. Do you like fobo? Yes. Oh, ah, yeah, the, yeah, the soup. <laughs> what advice would you give to other Western travelers? 
Come to Vietnam. <laughs> I think the uh, Jiang Lu tour because you have always a nice view uh, on the motorbikes and they are very friendly. They are yes. Thank you for your time. <laughs> yeah, thank you're welcome. Thank you, thank you too. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, how are you doing? Hi. Hi. Fine. <laughs> I'm fine. Where are you from? We are from uh, Paris, France. Paris, me too. Beautiful city. Yeah, yes. beautiful, yeah. How long is your trip in Vietnam? In Vietnam, uh, 10 days. 10 days, yeah. Yes, 10 days in Vietnam. Will you go to other countries? Yeah, our country. We will go to Cambodia. And the next week, we will go to Thailand. The trip uh, during one month. Why did you decide to travel to Vietnam and uh, other countries? Because we want to travel in Asia oh. yeah. uh, to discover the culture, the lifestyle, the, the space, jungle. the temples. In general, the culture, the Asian culture. Yeah. And the food. The food, of course. Yeah. <laughs> and Pierre has already spent weeks in uh, Bali and Thailand. So, yes, you want to discover more. And for me, it's the first time. And uh, you can enjoy the beach. Yeah, <laughs> in the Danong. The last day in, uh, in the Danong. It's our last day in uh, Vietnam. Oh, oh so, okay. yeah. yes. How was it in Vietnam? Did you enjoy it? Very uh, nice. Yeah, very nice. Yes. It's a very nice country. Huh? Yes, there's a lot of things to do. Yeah. We spend a lot of time uh, in uh, temples, in uh, jungle. Jungle. There's a lot of things to discover in Ninbin. Ninbin Bin is the best. Oh. <laughs> I think it's easy to make friends in Danang. Yes, uh, I, I, because we don't spend a lot of time uh, during the nightlife oh, okay. here. But uh, for example, in Hue, Wait. we were in Hue. It's very nice. Yes, oh. it's very easy to make friends. Yeah. People are really um, open minded in uh, Vietnam, very friendly. Do you have any advice for other Western travelers? Be curious, be yeah. because you have to be curious for food, for example. You have to try something and sometimes, uh, for example, we rented scooter, motorbike. Yeah, motorbike for me is in Asia. It's so important. Yes, very for, important. Uh, very to important. Be, yes, to be free, to go that right, left, right, left and to discover everything. Yeah. And, and uh, You have so many activities. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Yes, it's crazy. So many activities and like uh, uh, Sapa, Ninbin, Along Bay. Uh, Along Bay. Along Bay it's so nice. Yes, Ho Chi Minh. And way for the, the night is better. <laughs> way for the nightlife and be yeah. curious and uh, enjoy the trip. Yeah. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, man. Merci beaucoup. <laughs> <laughs> Subscribe. <laughs> Where are you from? Ireland, Dublin. What brought you to Vietnam? Travel, culture. Oh. Um, somewhere different, a lot different to Ireland. The weather. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> nice and warm. Weather. Yeah, it's very um, warm. Yeah, cheap as well. And it's very pretty, the views. What do you do for a living? I am a buyer, so I buy for pharmacy in Ireland. Um, all the beauty side of things. So when you walk into a pharmacy in Ireland, all the beauty stuff you do need. Um, I used to work in a gym, but I quit to come traveling. <laughs> but you look very healthy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So I think so. <laughs> <laughs> so it makes us look good. Where is your favorite place in Vietnam? Hajang. Uh, the Hajang Loop. Yeah, we yeah. did the Hajang Loop and we loved Hajang. And then I think probably Hoi An. Hoi An? Right, Diang, Hoi An, probably be second for me. Ninbin? Yeah, I like Ninbin. It's very pretty. Do you do any sports? Yes. We yeah. play soccer. A soccer? Yeah. And Gaelic. And Gaelic. Oh, uh, you're football. You look like an athlete, right? <laughs> <laughs> I did gymnastics for years and coached gymnastics. Oh, gymnastics. Yeah. Have you faced any culture shock in Vietnam? I'm struggling with the food. The food. And all the mopeds, the bikes. <laughs> Trying to cross the road. <laughs> yeah, yeah. A few near death experiences there. Yeah. Um, but no, I think food and yeah, mopeds. You yeah. don't realize how fast speed it all is, fast yeah. pace. There are only a few traffic lights. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So and they don't use them anyway. <laughs> <laughs> they don't stop. What are you proud of about your country? The people. Yeah, we're very friendly. Yeah, the people. Uh, really welcoming, friendly. Versus other places we've seen so far, it's not as opening or as warming to when you come to Ireland. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's better. You're very friendly. Yeah. Actually. I'm funny. <laughs> thank you for your time. No problem. Thank, thank you. you. Have a nice trip. You too. Thank you. See you later. Hi. How are you doing? Hi. I'm fine. How are you? Yeah. Good. Thank you. Where are you from? I'm from Armenia. How long is the trip in Vietnam? It's already two months. What brought you to Vietnam? The culture and the sun. Yeah. I'm in love with Vietnam. Have you faced any culture shock in Vietnam? At first it was streets in Ho Chi Minh City they ignore red light and it's so hard to 
past the street and the second is food, night markets and food. What do you do for a living? I'm a graphic designer. What's your favorite thing in Vietnam? Food, bun sale. How much is the budget for the trip in Vietnam? I think $1,000 in a month. Hi, how are you doing? We're good. 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 Yeah. yeah. Where are you from? Uh, Denmark. We went to uh, Thailand first and then uh, after that we like took two weeks in uh, Hong Kong and then uh, a little over a month here in Vietnam. How's your impression of Vietnam? Very good. Okay. It's nice, beautiful, a lot of things to do. Yeah, like a very beautiful nature. Where is your favorite place in Vietnam? Yeah, Da Nang. Da Nang or I also like uh, Ha Long, especially Ha Long Bay. I think it's such a beautiful place uh, out the trip we took. Uh, yeah. A very beautiful place. Yeah. What do you do for a living? Right now, like we have a gap year, but like we were working, he was working in a restaurant, and I was working in a supermarket. Thank you for your time. You're welcome. Yes. Yeah. Thank you. Tak. Tak tak. Hi. How are you doing? Hello. I'm good. Thank you. Where are you from? I'm from Germany. What brought you to Vietnam? I actually always wanted to come here to Vietnam, and then I looked up the flights, and I just found a perfect flight to come here and then I decided to come. And I just love Vietnam. I'm happy to be here. What do you like about Vietnam? I love the people, I love the culture, also love like the beach, the sea, the weather, especially the weather. I didn't like it that much in Hanoi, but here in Da Nang, it's just perfect for me. It's a beautiful beach here. Yeah, it's amazing. Where did you visit in Vietnam so far? I started my trip in Hanoi, so up north. Um, I flew there and then I came down to Da Nang because I just wanted to enjoy the weather and the beach. And then also I went to Hoi An, which is like 30 or 40 minutes down south from here. And then I remembered that I just loved Da Nang and came back. <laughs> I just love the beaches, but in Hoi An there was like night market. And there was like lanterns everywhere and lights and um, that was just one of the most amazing places I've ever been to, I think. Do you eat Vietnamese food? Yes, I'm addicted to the Vietnamese oh, really? food. I'm gonna miss it so much when I go back to Germany because uh, I just love the diversity and eating like, a lot of rice and rice pasta and stuff, but I just love it. I also love the Vietnamese pizza. Actually, that's like fried rice paper. The best, better than normal pizza, I think. <laughs> Do you go to the gym in Vietnam? Yes, actually, I am going here like every third day. And you can just like pay for a day. And yeah, it's amazing. Is it cheap to go to the gym here? It's like one or two euros. I don't know if that says okay. anything to you, but for me, it's very cheap. Yeah. Oh, yeah, very cheap. <laughs> How much is the budget for the trip in Vietnam? My budget is 1,500 for the whole month. Like I'm not doing a lot of trips. I'm not doing like every touristic attraction here. So I think if you like do a trip every day, you might need a little bit more than that. But yeah, I also have like some days where I just lie here at the beach and like discover the cities and then it's fine. What advice would you give to other Western travelers? I would say just discover the world, come here to Vietnam, it's amazing, you're gonna love it, you're gonna enjoy it. What do you like and dislike about Germany? Actually, I think I love or I like the traffic in Germany more. Sometimes I feel a little bit scared of the traffic here. You just have to be careful. You can't be with your mobile and walk over the street. That's too dangerous. I'm looking forward to this in Germany. And also it's, sometimes it's just a little bit more structured. You feel a little bit safer, I think. Thank you for your time. Thank you very much. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> very good.